Hello and welcome to the New India Junction newscast where we cover positive development stories in India. Let's take a look at the stories for today. I'm your host Priyanka Deo and today is Monday, June 3rd, 2019. First up, the economy. India's GDP can reach 7.5%. That's according to Goldman Sachs CEO David Solomon. The reason Solomon gives is the re-election of Prime Minister Modi has been a major confidence booster for organizations like Goldman Sachs. And if reforms keep accelerating, Solomon says, there can be considerable upside in GDP growth. Solomon also says that the accelerated reforms will also result in increased FDI flow. And next, Swatch Powder 2.0. After his re-election, Prime Minister Modi is expected to switch focus on the allied issue of water. Now, as promised in his election rallies, the new Ministry of Jal Shakti, led by Rajasthan MP Gajendra Singh Shikawat, under Modi 2.0, has already started working on plans to provide piped water connections to every household in India and aims to complete this goal and target by year 2024. And finally, Make in India hits Australia. The Sydney Metro in Australia has started running trains that are fully automated, driverless and made in India. It recently opened its first driverless line which will be served by over 20 Indian-made driverless trains which have been manufactured in Andhra Pradesh. This is yet another achievement of Modi's Make in India program. And that's a wrap for all of our stories for today. If you enjoyed watching this video, be sure to like and share it with your friends and family. Also, be sure to leave a comment below because I want to know your opinion on these stories. And most importantly, please, please, please subscribe to New India Junction. We could use all the support that we can get from all of you. It's super easy on YouTube. All you need to do is hit the subscribe button right here. With that being said, we'll see you next time on New India Junction Newscast. Till then, this is Priyanka Deo signing off.